and Superboy Duho Choi, the majority of his pro wins have come by first round knockout, something his opponent is acutely aware of coming in here tonight. Oh, Superman punch! Lands a jab. Done with the high kick. Relax, relax. Keep your hands up for me now. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Let me see that now. Come on. Trying the flying knee there. Mixed up the target, attacking the body. Whiffs on that offering. Choi gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Try to establish that jab. Pretty fast jab. Now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Just misses with the jab there. Right hand good on the counter. Joy gets caught with that punch. Everything works off of the jab, doubles up on it there. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Work, work, come on. Ooh. Gets in close and gets that single collar tie locked in tight. What a nasty kick. That was thrown with ill intent. Oh, nice hook. Swing and a miss by Choi. That was a big check. Just over two minutes, round one. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Nice jab there by the Korean Super Bowl. He's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shots that he landed. Great job. That left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. <laughs> Establishing the jab. All right, so another ringing jab right there, snapping his head back like a Pez dispenser. You can tell he was a former boxer. Yeah, absolutely. You can tell that that is his base. The way that he throws the jab is fundamentally sound. He does it like he was trained to do it as a young boy. And right now, behind that jab, he finds himself ahead. Five seconds to go here in round one. Right, oh, gets out to beat his opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Katie Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he lands that overhand right, he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. 20 seconds to go in round one. Just out of range with that left hook. Guess the single collar tie now. That horn sounds means we 
have reached the end of round one. All right, man, take a seat, bro. That was awesome. He really hurt him there, okay? He's in trouble. There's no way he's gonna recover. I need you to get out there, and I want good heart. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. You ready to fight? You ready? Second it. round underway. All right, this should be good as our next round gets underway. We nearly had a knockout in the previous round, but Connor seems to think they have their fighter back in the game. It felt fun watching such an exciting moment, but it is a testament to this fighter in the toughness and the durability that he possesses, that he's still here right now with an opportunity still to win the fight. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, nice. Oh, hook to the head by the Korean Super Bowl. Continuing to go to the head. Reach advantage was his at the outset, and he was able to take advantage there with the punch. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just like oh, that. It's a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. <laughs> lands a quick jab. A little single collar tie there. He lands a switch knee. And they separate. Nice shot. Lands downstairs. That's a solid punch. That one definitely got through. Choi's shot is blocked. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Two minutes have gone by. Out of range with that one. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Bleeding now, nasty cut on his nose. Huge damage to that elbow in the clinch. Fast leg kick lands. Oh, a huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Big right hand. That leg kick hurt. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, man, it ain't Dikembe Mutombo, but he is blocking all these shots coming man, this way. get that out of here. He sees it coming. You're going to have to mix it up. Shake that finger. Shake that finger. All right, well, that blow is busting from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with a super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that crimson red is nothing more than something that inspires him to continue doing what he's doing. So you have got to change something. you got to get your head moving so you're not taking too much damage to that cut. Different round in the striking clinic continues. Shades of Max Holloway back in the day against Calvin Cater. Every strike he has thrown seemingly is fine in the top. I mean, it's, it's landing. Everything is landing, J.A. And coming into this fight, he understood that he had an advantage in this particular skill. I don't know if he could have even expected it to be this vast as we have seen to this point in the fight. There is the kick. That one checked by the Korean Super Bowl. Back 
and forth we go. 30 seconds to go in round two. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Seconds winding down in round two. Two rounds in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. All right, well, I'm no doctor. I'm not going to diagnose a broken nose, but a huge cut on the bridge, and his opponent continues to attack it. Continues to attack it as he should. He did the damage. He was the one that landed the shot that opened up that cut. Now he's got to make his opponent pay for it. He was a bit lax in the defense, and now he's got that massive cut on the bridge of his nose. You ready to fight? You ready? Third round underway. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous frame. Yes, it wasn't a far fight. It wasn't two guys going to kick the sink at each other. But you did see times where they came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Straight right hand now just misses. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy can play up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it come. Connects with a beautiful jab. Able to land with the left hand. Somehow, his opponent stayed upright. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Well, that overhand, big weapon for him throughout his career, it's been there all night. Look for him to go back to it here. Joy gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Inside leg kick lands. They both are prepared. These are the types of fights that we expect. All right, so the overhand has certainly been a big weapon for him here tonight. Look for him to go right back to it here if he can find an opening. Swing and a miss with that punch by Choi. All right, now you see some visible damage on that calf. We'll keep an eye on that. You got to watch it. I mean, this kick is so damaging. Under three minutes now to go in round three. Nice jab there by the Korean Super Bowl. All right, so a seminal blow earlier in the round. It wasn't a knockdown, but it was certainly a stunner that caught his attention. Oh, I mean, he got hurt bad. To see him still standing, that just goes to the toughness that he has to be still standing after taking such a damaging shot. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Oh, effective strike there by the Korean Super Bowl. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to, start to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now and it's starting to show itself. Keeping busy now, connecting with those punches. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see it. Stun, jump driving out there. We'll see if he can recover. And how much more can he take? Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Oh, man, DC, he would appear to be in real trouble. Man, 
looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault, and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. Let's go. Use your footwork and keep that right hand up for me. Well, he's looking for that left hand just out of range, though, with it. 45 seconds remain in the round. Lands a beautiful leg kick. Well, he misses with the left punch there. 30 seconds to go in the round. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Shore. His nose is all crooked, it's all beat up, it's bleeding. He got hurt bad. That nose looks broken. 15 seconds. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. in the books. All right, we're going to stay with him and follow him back to the corner to the stool because that is a really severe cut that he is dealing with. We'll see if the cut man can stem the bleeding here. All right, DC, we got a few clips of the damage done in that round. Can see where things really started to escalate. Yeah, really open up that cut, John. The blows are just devastating. He's got to get out of the way more. I mean, if this guy won't do it himself, Somebody's got to help him. Yeah. Because you cannot keep taking these types of shots. You ready to fight? Ready. Go we ahead. have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Oh, nicely done to block the strike and counter with the jab. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. He was able to block that shot. Wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Oh man, he's a hard. Both fighters throwing heat now. Man, that cut is just getting worse by the minute. Rated R tonight. Clean left punch followed by the right. Oh man, hit to land. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Landed that left hook. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to knock gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Oh, nice. So a big knockdown for him in the previous round. Confidence is high and building here in this next round. Confidence is key, and he has a ton of it right now. Hands high, hands high. Still plenty of time with which to work here round four. Huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Take down. He gets to the second color tie. Look for him to wear on his opponent by pulling the head down and punching with the free hand. Oh, lands a beautiful jab. He missed with that jab attempt there. Oh, he's big right in. Clean with the right hook. Obvious. Oh! Two minutes to go. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Big shot lands to both guys. All right, single collar tie now. Look at the skip action that allows you to land that big knee. 
punch got blocked there. Beautiful punch lands. Well, when you absorb damage like this, you start to worry about a guy missing the rest of the year. At what point, if you're the referee, do you call in the ringside physician? Well, right now, yeah. uh, I feel like a bit, a little bit ago. You could have... Well, at this point, DC, I'm not sure if he's just biding his time or just trying to get some extra reps, but go finish the guy. It seems like the guy's playing with his food. You know, he's having a good time out there. Everything's working. He's in the zone. It feels like at any moment he can end the night of his opponent. But he seems to be having fun. And hey, to each his own, I guess, I'd be rushing out of that octagon. Yeah, you don't play with your feet. No. Well, he's had next to no answers for the body shots here tonight, and now some redness really starting to develop on that side. We're starting to see the damage. We're starting to visibly see the effect that all these body strikes are taking on this guy. He's got to do something different, and he's got to be very careful because look for his opponent to go over the top now that he set him up. Oh, how clean is that jab by short? 20 seconds left. Oh, he's bleeding like crazy, champ. The stream is steady. At what point do you at least call in the doctor to look at the cut? You got to right now. I mean, right now, someone should be in here looking at how they can save this fighter from himself. Collar tie here in the clinch. 20 minutes in the can, five to go. All right, there's the end of the round, and hopefully not the end of the fight. He doesn't look as handsome as he did when he walked out. That is a severe gash on his face. Don't be stupid. All right, let us now get you some replays of all the damage done in that previous round, including the strike that opened up the cut. Yeah, some nasty strikes landed over the course of that round, and it opened up a nasty cut. He has got to find a way to change some things defensively, or that cut is just going to get worse and worse. And the worse it gets, the more he runs the risk of this fight getting stopped. Ready to fight. Ready. Fifth and final round. Nice kick. Yep. Another nice combination to the head. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see it. Looking for that left hand, not there. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. Oh, big shots getting through. Uppercut. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off and take your time. He's right for the pinkie. Go and pick the fruit. <laughs> right through the air and he lands the knee. Oh, that's big. All right, so when is too much too much? I mean, I'm not... Oh! Back to the feet. Straight right, he misses. Beautiful body kick. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Oh, outstanding placement as he lands the knee to the body. Again, the taller fighter making noise with a knee strike there. Ooh, big shot lands. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following a game plan. He's got to either go southpaw or he has to actually just try to throw the whole kitchen sink at him. Good straight hand there by Choi. Right hand, yup. Well, if this fighter gets back to the stool, he's gonna get an ear. Oh, he's in trouble. He gets back to his feet. Oh, huge left. It's a 
nice jab by him there. Oh! And that'll do it! Do Hong Choi! With a huge knockout tonight! Yo, wow! That was nasty! And here once more with the official decision is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 39 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Boy, Do Ho Chong.